Welcome to the newest installment of Does She Still Have It? Today we're gonna find out with this red velvet magma from my friends over at Monster Peppers. Don't ask me how many Scovels, cause I don't know. Don't ask me a history on it, I don't know that either. Don't ask me what it tastes like, I don't know. But we gonna learn today. Cut her open to see if she's still good on the inside, and she is for the most part. Now all the times that you see them boys on here say no reaction. That's not gonna happen today. <laughs> not gonna happen today. I have had my tolerance so high that I could eat multiple insanely hot peppers, like Carolina Reaper style peppers, and like carry on about my day like nothing ever happened. But my tolerance has fallen considerably, which should make for excellent entertainment for you. Also, I'm immediately, it's immediately hot. Also, TikTok is now giving us 10 minute videos. So I should have to be cutting this at the end. Oh, that's the first half. <coughs> Am I just gonna go right in for the second half? I don't know. Let's think about this for a minute. It took me a good year last year <gasps> to build my tolerance to the point where I could eat the peppers that I used to eat. And then <gasps> life happened. And I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get a lot of peppers anymore. I didn't get a lot of peppers anymore. And I had to go be a grown people. And that really, that really cut into my pepper eating party. Hope it now. <gasps> uh, thanks to my friends over at Monster Peppers. We're back. Back again. Oh. It's hot. Uh, <gasps> it's hot. Okay. It's been a long time since I had the hiccups. Oh, this is hot. Huh. Oh, shit. What's that you say? Huh? Sorry. Oh, my ears are ringing. Can't hear you all that well. Did you say? Take that part two? Okay. So here's the thing. Oh, this is gonna burn. So here's the thing. I love supporting small batch, small business hot sauce. But I also love supporting pepper growers. And what I love the most about monster peppers is his integrity to his peppers. I just spit on you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Did that burn? I bet it smarted some. It's definitely smarting me. Monster peppers grows with integrity. He also grows not only some of the tastiest or hottest peppers, but I feel like Monster's Pepper, Monster Peppers claim to fame is how big they grow their peppers. And yeah, we had two more to do. Not today. Maybe in a, maybe in like a month or so. I might have beasted up again. But that's the thing. Tolerance to heat is like tolerance to anything else. The more you subject yourself to it, the more you power through it, and the more you teach yourself to power through difficult things, it gets easier and easier and easier. My love for peppers is only heat deep because my genuine love is for the entire experience. The love that grows into, goes, into, goes into growing good peppers. The community that comes from being a pepper head, chili head, the sense of accomplishment when you survive something this hot, and teaching myself what I'm capable of. It's like running a marathon. And if peppers are too extreme, check out hot sauces. Hot sauces are the same way, especially ones that challenge you. My whole mouth feels like it's being stung by bees. Woo! Woo! 
Oh, and here's the thing. So like, we ate the first half, let the capsaicin and the heat build. Ate the second half, let that heat <coughs> keep building. Sometimes it's easier just to eat the whole dang thing at, the first, at one time. We didn't do that today. We're also like six minutes deep. And I think it is not subsiding. It's not going to get any worse either. So it's all going to get better from here. Monster peppers, thank you so much. If, if you guys are interested in growing some of your own insanely big peppers, Monster Peppers has the seeds. Monster Peppers also grows gigantic peppers that you can try yourself or make sauces with or whatever. So go follow them here on TikTok. Go check out their website. I'm gonna go get some milk now. I'll get it right here in front of God and everybody. I don't care. Milky. <laughs> Ain't no shame in being a bitch. You know what I'm saying? I even a little bit sometimes only. Like, 